Hey, how are you? I'm fine. Yeah. So, uh, you were a Delhi student, a uh, foundation back student. Uh, no, ma'am. I I joined in my uh, internship, uh, like the 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 TND batch and the online resources batch. Yeah. All right. All right. So, uh, Rinsi, shall we start? Yes, ma'am. Good to go. All right. So hello everyone and again I'm very excited to have uh, top rankers with us of the recent INICET 2021. Hello Dr. Chiranjeev. Hi ma'am, good to be here. Yeah, so how are you feeling to be amongst the top teams recent INICET? Uh, ma'am, actually the exam was so unpredictable that uh, like any rank would be uh, would you have to be happy for that because the paper was actually very very unexpected and unpredictable like even even the top 10 ones say the same thing even the 500 ones same, say the same thing so it was yeah. a very very topsy-turvy paper and we have seen quite a few shuffles also so you have to be thankful for whatever rank you get in this exam yeah but uh, uh, one thing you will agree with me that uh, uh, as you said that the paper was unpredictable i think uh, the last one and a half year was also very very unpredictable <laughs> yes. you can say, you can say that right? <laughs> yes yes now and uh, to, uh, i think you have uh, received a very good rank but to get any rank in such conditions is really incredible so uh, what do you have to say how did you manage in such an unpredictable uh, you know environment with so much of you know negativity yes ma'am so ma'am actually yes uh, yes ma'am actually uh, from right from april 15th when our need was postponed it has been uh, such a roller coaster ride why why sinai has been postponed so it was always like you gear up, you you set an end date, and then again you get a postponement. You again get a court hearing, and again get something. So, it it was tough to maintain focus, and uh, the, it it might have contributed because you can't stay at a peak for so many months. You basically yes. plan your peak regarding an exam that I'll peak around here. I'll plan my revisions, I'll plan my previous years papers like that. So. Uh, to to be honest, so it it was it was tough. It was actually distracting because the tournament seat postponement was actually heartbreak for everyone because yes. uh, like 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 really well like we had been expecting it from in Jan then it postponed to April. We so in in midst of all that, I and I C T also got postponed twice. So um, it was it was actually very tough. It it was tough to maintain any 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 rhythm in our studies. Yeah, it was tough. So that that's the question. I want to ask you that how did you manage? See, uh, all those of you are rankers this year. I think they are rankers of whole time because you people will be remembered. Uh, <laughs> pandemic will go, but you know, you people managed to have, uh, you know, that pace in this time and that too with a good score. So I think uh, your your message is really, really important for the uh, aspirants to go because yes, every time we will not have pandemic, but every time in the life of a PG aspirant, we have ups and downs, we have yes, roller coasters. Yes, so I think you people are the best example to show them that how did you manage your pace in so much of negativity and uh, so much of unpredictability. Uh, yeah, ma'am, ma I feel like it's important for you to uh, grade your resources and preparation into levels because you can't, uh, you can't in the last one week revise your notes which you have made in your classroom. So you need to have levels of your preparation, mm -hmm. and that is very important. Like, like uh, my original notes or something which I, I haven't read them for uh, like the past two months since the INI date, like uh, the date came because you have to know what resources to focus on and what mm -hmm. things to do because if you uh because so that when you get a like you get a 20 day post like we got a 40 day postponement so i knew what all i had to focus in those 40 days i can't be like i don't know what to do so you need to level your preparations that mm -hmm. from the basic ones building up building up to, towards mm -hmm. the exam and what to do in the last Two weeks before the exam that is very important so you need to have those resources ready with yourself 
so if yeah, you yeah basically it means it's a journey and uh, when you are at different levels of your journey you can't be same so you have yeah. to be ready for that yes yes Oh, all right perfect. so uh, uh, let's start with your uh, starting phase how did you started your preparation and how uh, like we uh, we have been helping you uh, ma'am uh, ma'am uh, uh, in the starting years it is very very important to uh, make your uh, uh, notes uh, uh, notes and from and also fairly fairly important to have a good knowledge base so you yes. can't actually start jump into the preparation without having good knowledge base so uh, so in during our college years it, it was very important to balance your uh, uh, postings clinical knowledge along with the uh, fair bit of standard books knowledge and your notes so balancing that basically till the end of your final year gives you a good launching pad to start your preparation in your internship so mm -hmm. if in, in your internship you don't have the resources you have then it will becomes a bit tough so if you have got your 19 resources uh, even if you don't know anything if even if you have not given gt if you know if you're not given anything at mm -hmm. the start of internship if you have the 19 resources set that this is my basic resources and and one need one needs to understand that resources also have always have to be built upon you can't expect a single resource to have give you the entire uh, journey from the your start of internship to your exam you need to build upon that resource with mm -hmm. multiple tnds multiple gt reviews multiple everything you always add information into that resource so, so that is I very i think important. you you followed our tnd course right yes ma'am i i followed as uh, i followed you regular in giving the test uh ma'am uh, ma'am actually I, i started with the offline tnd in jan 2020 then 3 months later it was all Has has a no 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 online. So everything we shifted to online. So mm -hmm. after shifting to online, then it uh, then we also got our posting suspended because internship. Uh, so ma'am, it was a bit has has that. So I basically made it a point to look try and see what what all I can do. Like I I think I attended three. I attended Doctor Rajat Jain's T N D and Ashwini Sir's and. Ravin sir, offline at that point of time, okay. yes, before yes. the pandemic. So after mm -hmm. that, uh, uh, on online I attended Jaisal online. So after that, it it uh, uh, after that I I picked and selected. Then so uh, when you are so haphazard, like uh, uh, what do you think that this T N D schedule that you are getting uh, does it help you to make a good timetable? Because uh, in the internship, when you yes, you do not know where to start from and yes, how to go about all the nineteen subjects, uh, and I think the major challenge that the students uh, face is yes, how to go about the subjects one after the other. Ma'am, uh, ma the T N D which like which like completes your syllabus in about I think eight months is a very very nice schedule. so it basically because you have to be a bit uh, you have to be a bit rapid and fast in your revision and uh, sometimes it will be okay that you are attending a tnd half prepared you have yes, to allow yes. your, every your, time your you cannot be 100% uh, prepared yeah, before attending uh, the test and one one thing is very important that uh, don't read too much into tnd marks always keep your focus on gts because tnd you don't know you studied two days for that tnd someone might have studied two weeks Yes. So yes. for TNDs, I always uh, uh, always tell everyone not to read too much into TNDs. TNDs are a way to uh, not evaluate evaluate it. It's a way to learn. It's a way to learn your approach and and of course every TND adds new stuff into your new original knowledge. Notes. Yes. Mm -hmm. So th that is very important that you need to keep that in your mind that don't get too hustled that you got fifty rank out of. One fifteen. Yeah, I think course. the students get quite emotional about it, yes. and I always say that keep it as a learning tool. Don't keep it as yes, a testing course, tool. And uh, if you are using it as a learning tool, you will end up learning more. Even from your, course. I think the main notes you are learning mm -hmm. more from that. Yes. And uh, uh, were you giving the GTs also? Uh, yes, ma'am. Ma'am, I I started my GTs uh, during a township. I like like a few of my classmates had. You started giving it in final year because, but I was not in a position. So I started giving GTs in my internship, like last year, uh, April May. So uh, of course, the first one, few ones were bad, and then you you get a phase like you do four subjects, you do good 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 in that GT, but you do bad in the four subjects you did four months ago. So that is pretty normal, and it 
keeps happening you don't have to read too much you have to read into attempting the paper and moreover uh, the the subjects you have done recently that are very important in the gt so even gts have to be assessed with a very wide view you can't be like i have i'm doing bad in gt so i'll do bad in like that unless yes. After, yes like 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 ma'am like i i think i was not even a part of the super 30 until end of last year so i i actually started getting a top 30 rank in, till the end of last year so after that i have been in the group and which has been very but really now i me. think this year super 30 are really super 30 and each one of you have qualified and and has come up with a very very good score so i thought that this idea was quite great of making yes ma'am ma'am ma ma uh, I, I, i don't I, i don't think anybody else has this idea and it is very 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 useful because even like to be honest i have not asked much doubts in the group but you know like yes. at the end of the day you like just go through all uh, the doubts i don't think that i have uh, given you any no, uh, ma 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 I, i have i have barely <laughs> i have barely asked but you know like everyone asks and uh, you get to that. know from the others yes, doubts yes. also so, <laughs> uh, everyone is of that you know everyone has the, those doubts or those uh, mm -hmm. things you you learn because so basically that is a very very good forum and i actually very liked it And I think faculties are also very prompt at uh, answering at that yes, yes, group. I have yeah. seen faculties one a.m., two a.m. They are answering like anything. Yes, so yes. I thought, अच्छा, okay, I am also answering, but other people are also answering at the same time. Like, yes, ma'am, and like, like it, it, it gets a bit tedious to you know, like message them on Facebook or post yes. in the group. facebook group and then sometimes they get lost and you don't have to keep so, so that it it is a very very convenient and a very very good feature which i enjoyed during yeah, the past yeah you are months. like you people are directly connected to all the yes, uh, you know esteemed faculties i think it's yes. a great idea right so um, what about the image based session did you attend it the vibe uh ma'am why no ma'am did not because at that point of time uh, i was kind of i was not in that preparation to attend vibe so I I did not attend that. Uh, but a few of my friends there. I I flipped through the booklet. It was actually quite comprehensive. So I I actually thought about reading it, but then it became too much to uh, okay. read without uh, without attending the session. So I did not. Okay. Uh, because you were talking a lot about the um, quality learning during your uh, years. So what do you think of the textbook reading? How much importance do uh, you give to the textbook reading? Ma'am, uh, ma'am, uh, it basically uh, becomes a very personal choice because if I say blankly that read textbooks, there would be a lot of people who would read textbooks and not gain anything. So that yeah, it, I want it, your personal opinion. I want I know that people have divided opinions, so don't be diplomatic yes, about that because uh, ma I, I want your opinion. Yes, ma'am, uh, ma'am, ma personally, uh, the two textbooks I have loved are Robbins and Harris. And these yes. are the two textbooks. So I you have. were able to finish them. Uh, okay. Robbins mostly, and Mam Mam Harrison is a journey that you have to you have to learn yes. how to study Harrison. You can't yes. be like I study Harrison. You have to first learn how to study Harrison. So that is mm -hmm. one thing you have to understand. That uh, uh, because because mm -hmm. when I first opened Harrison, it was like yar. No, no, it's not possible. But like o, over the years, you see, you understand the point. So basically, every textbook is not possible. Like I have not opened Parsons. Okay. <laughs> it's are you uh, because okay. you know Parsons is smaller than Harrison's and Robbins. <laughs> no, 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 uh, ma'am, ma I. I Because it it comes down to interest. Like I did not have interest in surgery, so I did not. Ah, oh, that is why. <laughs> so I did not read Bailey at all. I was like, no, I won't read. So it it comes down to it's interest. It's actually obviously it everything is out of passion only, and yes. whatever you are passionate about, uh, it is done. Um, no matter how much difficult it is, yes, uh, but so, yes, definitely I think that textbook reading those actually those students read can only know what's the difference. Uh, yes, otherwise, you keep on uh, you know asking that is that not covered in notes? Yes, Everything yes, is there in Everything notes. Everything is covered in notes. In yeah, notes, like, like, but like, the thing is that the nothing can replace that textbook reading. Yes, When you read that book, so, you so, have something else, uh, uh, and you only have that. chance during your mbbs year so if yes. you have if you are starting getting serious in internship then no no point even asking that can i read this textbook 
then it's yes. best you follow the notes notes have yes. everything once you don't you, have the time then you should not waste time not waste. in reading but but like, but basically because because uh, a lot of people are like even in internship even after they don't know what they like so in that sense yes. uh, the, the reading textbooks makes them know what they like so that is important yeah i think this is also a good thing na like you came to know that you do not have an interest towards the surgery you have yes, an interest yes. and fair towards yes, the medicine yes. because uh, even uh, after getting a good score i have seen students messaging me that ma'am i have got a good score i can get any branch i know uh, i want but i do not know what i want so i don't want my students to be like that like yes, you ma'am. you should know what you, you want you should know actually yes. and i think two good important ways for that is do, doing the internship postings you have the, the postings, time postings. to revisit all the departments yes, you get to know that this is not my cup of tea like some people yes, as they enter the uh, pediatrics they say no humse <laughs> nahi ho payega <laughs> like they are always crying and some people are very good and uh, hand, at handling the uh, baby so you get to know that whether you yes, have an interest in medicine or pedi or you have an interest yes, in ma'am. surgeries yes, uh, exactly. and then obviously textbook reading is again a good idea of mm. knowing what you know because if you yes. do not know what what you want i think that is a because, very blind, yes, blind yes ma'am note. because uh, to be honest you won't be reading notes in your uh, pg so you you will read the textbooks in your pg so you know should know what level of textbooks they are what you will be reading and what you will be learning so that is important yes so any important message um, any do's or don'ts that you would like to give to your juniors ma uh, ma uh, 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 one thing i'll say that uh, uh, trust your growth curve you have everyone has his own growth curve you don't know the slopes okay so don't compare your starting point with the plateau of another one you, your your peak might be over their plateau that is one thing and because many people are like uh, people that these are very far away i won't be able to catch them and it has happened people have caught me i have caught people it happens it is uh, it is normal for everyone so that one thing is never too late to start because you can rise very rapidly so and it and always you have to have to be have a target have a passion towards a thing because uh reading solely for getting a pg or getting a rank is very difficult you need to have a passion about what you want to do in life that passion will fuel your studies so have that i must say you are not only intelligent you are wise also and a pretty good <laughs> piece of advice you have given very good so i think juniors must be lucky to hear you um acha one thing more uh, being a delhi student and um, we are uh, having a great affinity towards these uh, students you know big, uh, near to our hill office so what do you feel uh, what is the kind of uh, you know um, hospitality and uh, the cooperation are you getting enough uh, uh, kind of uh, attention and uh, cooperation uh, from the yes yes ma'am um, ma'am like uh, like in the uh if, even before the pandemic like even our uh, offline courses like we we want to attend a class here in the center or no we want to hear this we want to attend a shuni sir there or everything so that was pretty smooth out everyone we everyone thing we used to say they used to agree and everything and even after the online switch so there have been multiple uh, uh, my result is not coming this is not happening this is not opening yeah. so uh, it, it but it it, it gets smooth out pretty quickly like even like Uh, so they are, they, they are hearing you and they are resolving yes, your uh, yes, problems uh, yes ma'am and uh, ma'am i think uh, she is a lady all behind it and she takes extra care every time she meets me she says ki mere mere bachcho ka dekh lena and she is so you know passionate about the students yes. uh so i think um, a round of, of applause she also deserves for this and her staff they are yes, always ma'am. worried about you people and so many times yeah, we ma'am. we are requested to change our timings because students ko chahiye ya uh, yes uh, uh, maybe the venue is changed the time is changed sometimes faculty is changed ki students ke exam aa gaya ab abhi le lo and all this yes Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, ma'am, it 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 becomes a lot. So to manage, and like we we have not encountered any problem any ever on that front. Like everything has been handled and solved pretty quickly. Even the latter times, like the the online online hassles about accounts and results and rankings and this everything has been smooth. 
All right. So, uh, anything that you would like to say about um, uh, any of the faculties uh, or uh, the type of teaching that we are giving? Do you feel it is satisfactory? It is growing up with uh, the recent patterns of exams. Uh, yeah, yeah, yes, ma'am, 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 ma definitely though. Like, like, like when I attended the, the TNDs, they were actually of a pretty higher level than I thought. But and that is what it should be. The TNDs should challenge you. It should try to get you above like even the, yes, like they, the, like, they should like, be like, something which are you know motivating to push your limits so yes, that yes. you can think uh, in yes, the exam. Ma am, ma am like, uh, like 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 the, like uh, i attend like the, uh, like ashwini sir's tnd it was full of all cadaveric images which are very very important in the eventual mm -hmm. exam so mm -hmm. and even like post i and i the uh, the the flip in the pattern which happened so all uh, all the gts and every resources actually changed according to that the gts we had post the even the neat neat 300 to 200 flip everything mm -hmm. ha has been pretty accurate but actually uh, the paper actually came which was uh, opposite to what ev all teachers and all students expected like the, no one expected that th these many single liners or these many so uh, so uh, the, uh, the, the 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 preparation had been what we had expected and we had hoped for but the paper ended up surprising everyone so it was it was everyone yes. i think too easy paper is also not a very good thing uh, uh, because yes, that will not differentiate between the students who exactly. have read and who have not read yes yes ma'am so 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 this for paper was a kind of a, uh, abnormality i'll say in the sequence because we yeah. we would hope that meat would come up i think this paper. is the compensation they paid for postponing their <laughs> papers and uh, <laughs> you know keeping the students in that hold so they said okay give them a treat yes, uh, that, something that like that but uh, did you feel that uh, uh, maybe the questions are on the easier side but they uh, were from the topics which were high uh, yield which were covered in the yes, uh -huh. sessions Yes, ma'am. The, the the like like uh, if 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 we uh, like we don't know, know anyone's marks, but if we uh, estimate the uh, the 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 number the marks ranges will be pretty high in this paper. The paper mm -hmm. was on a whole level a bit easier, and it was from the topics they were from our notes and TNDs which we had, but they were more of facts like. The recent trend has been more towards application and yes. more towards critical mm -hmm. thinking. Mm -hmm. That is what we had hoped, we had expected. So that mm -hmm. was a bit of an aberrancy. But uh, uh, after the paper seemed a bit too easy, and the questions which were not easy were plain guesses. So that became a very you know, like like mm -hmm. a lot of us. Googlies are always there. Uh, like some of the googlies are always there in the paper, but yes, they might have given more uh, this time. Uh, but uh, do you think that if you are sticking just to the classroom notes, revising yes. classroom notes multiple times is the key? Yes, ma'am. Uh, 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 sticking to your classroom notes and then building up whatever you gain from the TNDs and GPs. That is the Main. Heading over to that, if you have already a confident that you have done with the classroom notes, then you can keep on adding from this mm. TND. Yes, yes. The, 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 uh, yes, yes, you need to have your resources and levels. So once you have, are confident with the classroom notes, you can get to the TND notes and then you always get a few questions, few good points in the GTs that you are new, new for you. So that keep adding them. All right. So, uh, giving after giving this paper, can you list uh, uh, some of the topics which you felt were high yield and there were a lot of questions from these topics so that the students who will be appearing in this uh, NEET PG can uh, ponder more on them? Ma'am, actually, uh, actually, there were a lot of previous year questions. Yes. So, previous years will remain important. Uh, they were important for uh, this time also. They will, will remain important. And mm -hmm. as such, topics of top of the head, I don't know because actually I haven't done the recall. I basically okay. switched off after 20 seconds. COVID that questions I, were there. Uh, COVID. Uh, yes, ma'am. Co co uh, COVID questions were uh, a bit less than I expected. I actually expected mo COVID questions to be more tricky, mm -hmm. tricky or uh, more conceptual. They were pretty easy. I think, I, I think all of them were, were kind of covered in our uh, COVID test which happened. Even the, uh, the, the, the the one in which, uh, how many weeks do you delay after a COVID, the elective surgery mm -hmm. one, that was also in our GP this time. So, there, so, yeah, so uh, the, yeah, 
this time the resources were not the limiting factor at all so you mm-hmm. knew but the fact is that you because you expected a different kind of paper there were about i think errors uh, from everyone even the top 50 ones even the top 10 ones from which they should have known but they didn't and that will happen because you can't be expected to know everything from your notes you will you will yes. miss out points so that is you will miss out point but you will make up for those in other questions so that is how papers were Mm-hmm. so you have resources were pretty pretty comprehensive uh, for this paper all the sources you did not have things there were weren't questions which you would have missed that other one would have done because mm-hmm. he or she has read more it, it mm-hmm. would only be because she or he or she happens to remember if that that would be yes so any piece of advice or some uh, lines on the strategy that uh, the students should follow for upcoming neat it's just 45 days away now so anything you would like to mention uh, uh, one day i would mention that i am still hoping it would be a, okay. a what we had expected on the lines because it has a, a 300 to 200 flip so i don't want i don't feel like people should start re- preparing themselves for one liners Mm-hmm. after this exam because i feel still feel this exam was an aberrancy so uh, yes. you have been prepared for that you have the, a very good uh, understanding of all the clinical questions approach questions which we have been doing in our gts for so long especially for the after since march when it uh, when it changed so try doing that and uh, and moreover uh, uh, for for neat you need to be very good on your basic concepts because it neat neat will not have those peculiar topics which aims has so try to be good on your basics and concepts for neat rather than uh, focusing on pit topics because neat 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 is kind of a paper which will test your basic and i am expecting it to be good this yeah so i think again a wonderful piece of advice all those who have uh, got good scores and good ranks in this examination it's very very good and we are very proud to have you but all those who have not uh, got so yeah. much uh, i think there is nothing to worry because a bigger exam is coming uh, and ma'am, uh, ma'am actually uh, like like so many people i have known even from our group who were consistently in the top 10 top 15 have been One fifty, three hundred, and um, mm-hmm. it was actually a. If you did not get because this this uh, this exam did not test your merits that well, because a lot of people who were consistently getting and who who are good have been uh, relegated to one fifty, three hundred, four hundred ranks. Mm-hmm. So that is that is pretty bad in my opinion. I think beyond a certain point, um, luck also um, a lot. it matters a lot and maybe this was not uh, there luck but next yeah. time that was that will be a bigger paper and everybody yes. will uh, come up to their expectations yes, so yes. thank you so much dr chiranjee once again heartiest congratulations and thank wish you, you all the very best in your future ahead examinations too thank you thank you